four to nothing Faith Christian as we head to the bottom of the sixth inning from Sunset Baseball Field and Brush. Derek Lynch will step in against Brandon Mokel. He struck out looking in the first and grounded back to the mound in the third. Wind and pitch, and the breaking ball is in the dirt. The three-run triple by Alex Buckman broke the scoreless game. And the 1-0 to D. Lynch. And that fastball is a strike right there. It's 1-1. One and one. Locally in Fort Morgan and Brushing, Meyer Phillips Insurance offers home, health, auto, farm, business, and workers' compensation insurance. And Meyer Phillips Insurance. 1-1 one, one pitch. Breaking ball is grounded to the second baseman, Smith. He's got it. Sets, throws, one down. Well, the bead diggers have really done a nice job putting the ball in play on the ground, too. But the thing is, is that this faith Christian defense has been too good. Mokel had five strikeouts in the first two innings, only one since the second. Here's Brad Bass, but every bead digger has been set down in this game. Except Sam Guzman, who's two for two. He's on deck. Wine in the pitch. Fastball down the middle for a strike. Thigh high, it's 0-1. Anything to spark the bead diggers. And the 0-1. The breaking ball is down and away. One ball and one strike. This team one year ago went to the state tournament, but it was an easier route. They beat a 14th seed and a 30th seed, and the curveball clipped Bass, and he's on. Hit by a pitch. Here's Sam Guzman, who singled and doubled. Remember the last time Bass was hit by a pitch, it preceded a Sam Guzman infield single and a John Hirschfeld two-run double to beat Erie 4-3. to three. Can that initiate a rally? Throw back to first, back in standing as Bass. Yeah, B diggers have got to at least dent the scoreboard here in the sixth and make this a game. Down four to nothing. The stretch. Pitch to Guzman. Fastball. A ball inside just off the corner. Northeastern Colorado's hometown savings and loan with locations in Brush and Fort Morgan is equitable savings and loan. Bass with a lead. And the 1-0. Fastball is high. Two balls and no strikes. Only one walk issued by Brandon Mokel in this game. Bead diggers have not been shut out all season. To throw back to first and back in standing is Bass. And a watch out here, Mokel. I don't think it's gone 3-0 to any hitter in this game yet. 2-0 to Guzman. And that curveball is upstairs. He threw a 2-0 curveball and it missed by a mile. 3-0. And yeah, sometimes it's harder to play with the lead, especially on the other team's home field. Who's been in there? 3-0 pitch. Swung on and fouled back. He swung at that pitch. He liked that fastball down the middle, but got under and behind it. It's 3-1. and one. John Hirschfeld and Arturo Maltos to follow. This could be a big inning if Guzman can get on the base pass. Mokel looks back at first. 3-1. Ooh, that ball nearly hit him, and Guzman walks. Well, this looks familiar. Maltos did this in the fourth inning. A hit batsman and two walks. Here we have a hit batsman and one walk. Here's John Hirschfeld, who struck out looking in the first and then walked in the fourth. He's 0 for 1. I mean, it's now for the bead diggers at this point. And the Faith Christian head coach, Gino Carbajal, out for a visit. Yeah, it is now or never for the bead diggers because the bottom of the order has done a nice job today of putting the ball in play, hitting it on the ground. But from hitters, actually 5 through 9, the bead diggers are 0 for 10. So now is definitely the time for Brush. Trailing four to nothing in the bottom of the sixth inning. We're going to have some activity down the right field bullpen momentarily. Mocha looks in the stretch. And the pitch. Swing and a missing a fastball at the letters. It's 0-1. That 
At second is Bass, at first is Guzman. Mokul gets the sign. And the offering. Curveball is taken for a strike at the knees. Wow, you got to be kidding me. 0 oh, and 2. Boy, that certainly was a rough call. No balls, two strikes. That looked like ball one. And the pitch. Swing and a miss on a curveball in the dirt. Hirschfeld went fishing for it. There's two down. Wow. And a strikeout, number seven. Only the second strikeout since the second. Yeah, that 0 1 pitch. I think that's what got Hirschfeld. I thought it was definitely a ball. So did many in the beat digger crowd. Mantle struck out and grounded to second. And he awaits the pitch. And he takes a fastball down the middle for a strike. Thigh high. It's 0 1. There's a big at bat for Arturo. Maybe the biggest of the season. And the pitch. Swing and a miss and a curveball. It's 0-2. No balls, two strikes, two outs, two on. Faith Christian leading 4 to nothing in the bottom of the six in this 3A District 4 championship game. Buckman lays down the sign. And the offering. Swung on. That ball is driven down the left field line, but that ball is foul. Boy, in Maltos' wheelhouse, but he pulled it. And that was no shot of staying fair. Looked like Mokul tried to surprise Maltos and almost burned himself. 0-2. Oh, Runners take their leads. And the pitch. Swing and a miss. Got him on the curveball, and the inning is over. No runs on, no hits, no errors, and two men left. Six complete. It's Faith Christian 4, brush nothing on 1010 KSIR and KSIR.com.